I got a review at 101 here. Uh, finally getting to do a review for you guys. Uh, this is the Nelio um, 600 watt, their M series. Picked it up on eBay, not eBay, but Amazon for 150. Um, has a bloom switch, a veg switch. Uh, supposedly covers four foot by four foot in the veg and three foot three during bloom. Um, supposedly uses 240 watts at the wall. But this is a different style light. And what I mean by that is it has different uh, optical lenses on it. These are supposedly 90 degree, but they're like half circle shape. I've yet to see these type of uh, lenses. So we'll see if they're good for par or footprint. Um, don't know much about the light. I think it's a relatively new company. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and get into testing in it. Verify the height first. Just a tad over 18 inches. And uh, this light probably not set up perfect to my uh, cardboard here. As you can see, first light, first review that I'm gonna do inside of a grow tent. So many people wanted a grow tent review. I don't know why the cardboard isn't reflective, so it's not gonna help with that. Um, that the grow tent really does anything anyway but yeah that's just what it is um all right go ahead and turn that on all right let's go ahead and uh get the bloom phase or the veg phase kind of pink kind of blue uh, real quick before I do that, the par they say it's supposed to achieve is right here 583 and this is their color spectrum. So very heavy on the blue, but it does have a nice balance of red. I'm going to go ahead and get the bloom on. Definitely turns way more pink after doing so. Um, pinkish, reddish color. And let's go ahead and check the watts. Probably should have put this in a different spot, but you know, whatever. 239 watts. So they are accurate with their wattage usage. Um, fans are kind of loud. Uh, like I said earlier, this thing does weigh 7 pounds. Um, kind of heavy light, so maybe they're using some quality products in there. Barely see the uh, results here. Blare off the screen. I think we're going to get 580 something that they were saying. But it does get 500. Make sure 
And that was supposedly at 24 inches height. <laughs> Glad I checked that because this is way off. Um, doesn't even get over, it gets barely over 500 at 18 inches. So they definitely need to update their chart on what it gets. It definitely doesn't come close to uh, nowhere near that. If, at 24 inches, if they're starting to tell you that it gets 589, it should be getting at least 700, 650 at 18 inches. And I know I've seen it at 500 at one point in time, but it hasn't been that high since. So let's just do a quick one by one. Three sixty, three forty, three ninety. Again, this could be off a little bit. Three eighty. It's a good one by one. I mean, at least it does a fair job about spreading it out. So. Uh, go out 16 inches approximately 16 inches from each corner 250 245 282 285 265, 263, 261, something like that. Uh, let's try to see all the way out here in the 2x2. Two two. 196. 161. Knock over the bar meter. Ninety-two, hundred and eighty-two. So, I mean, you're definitely going to get a two foot by two foot spread on this. I would still recommend turning the turning the plants or moving the plants. Um, overall, not a great light, not a terrible light. Uh, it seems like the lenses do more for equal foot spread. Than magnifying it and getting far. So if you're more interested in equal, like an equal spread, uh, this would be a great light for that. Uh, if you're just trying to get par, um, this light is not a par king. Um, but I am interested to tear this thing open and uh, check out what they got inside of there. Wow, why this this small? The light weighs seven pounds. Maybe it's got some really nice. Uh, guts inside of it. Maybe this light, even if it's uh, if you decide not to use it as the way it comes, you could use it, modify it, and make it better. Maybe put different lenses on it. Um, but that'll be another video, another time. I'll tear into it. Um, quick note: not gonna be doing the raffles. So I have to get a license for that. So I'm gonna be doing a Patreon. Hope to make another Patreon. Hope to make a Patreon video. Might even try getting that uploaded today. Already have the Patreon account, but uh, any of you guys looking towards the raffle, I won't be able to do that because they say I have to have a license, a gambling license, to do that. So I'm gonna be doing Patreon. Whoever pays or donates to Patreon, I'm gonna set it up in a once a month type of thing. Um, anybody who enters into that, then. I'll randomly select somebody and I'll call it a giveaway, but it'll just be basically anybody who donates to the account to keep the account going, uh, the channel going, will be entered and has a chance to do, uh, get a like. But more details on that later. As always, like and subscribe. This is the Neo 600 watt M-Series light. Thanks for watching. See you next time.